Okay, here on the home page, we're going to go to the advanced search, enter the advanced search. And whether you're signing up for a new account or you're just logging in to your new account, the process is pretty much the similar. Pretty much the same, it's real easy. You just click on login uh, and <coughs> right here I've kind of already signed up. So <coughs> after you enter your information, it'll have a message that says check your email and you'll have your password and username there. So I'm just going to pull that up. So you click on that email, it looks just like this. It tells you my password and my email address that I'm going to enter. So I'm just going to highlight the, the password, although I think it's actually automatically saved. Watch this, how easy this thing is. So I just enter the email, it just boom, you're into your account. Okay. Uh, when you get here it's pretty neat because uh, it just gives you some directions and even a tutorial video when you get in here you click on the home page to get into your account. I wanted to tell you first of all that when you run a search at any time here you can save that search now. Um, also to, f to be able to run a search uh, you'll notice the by the uh, short cell status that that place is right here we can either choose no or, no or active and I've ran a search uh, from 250k to 300k um, clicking on no to short sales and another search I ran I clicked on active to short sales and I also clicked the greater St. George area that's how you find the area on this search it's kinda tricky you have to ch click on this box or click on the little browse button and that's when the cities come up okay because it looks like you can't find a city this is how you do it and you, du you have to actually double click on the city to get it to go Okay, now I'm just going to bypass that search because we've ran a couple searches and saved those searches. There's a save feature right there. And when you do, when you, when you run those searches, you just click on view results first and then the results pop up and then you choose the save and, and it will save them in here. And here's those searches that I ran. I ran two of them. And then what I came in and did was I clicked this little box that says daily email updates. And that is what gives you your uh, ability to... Uh, have appear in your email box the updates the new listings of the short sales those new listings will come from this saved search that you ran here when you click on daily email updates it gives you email updates on those two searches so you'll have all the regular listings the non short sale listings as well as just the actives so you can bypass having to look through all the stuff that's already got offers on it Okay, that's a little bit about how to do that. And um, if you need a tutorial on how to run this in here, you just click the help button and then click on the video. And that will give you the video tutorial on how to use the rest of the features in here. You can save your favorites, possibilities, and rejects. Um, anytime you're moving through the listings um, and you're logged in, uh, it will automatically categorize them in here. And when you come back in, uh, you'll see happy and smiley faces on all the listings. I'll just run one of these searches right now, active short sales. You just click on it and it automatically runs the search again. And you'll notice that it has saved and logged a copy of what I've already rated. So that, you know, if there's new listings, boom, now you can all rate those as well. And so you're never missing anything. And I just wanted to show you that. And of course, another feature you don't want to miss is this map it function. This is really cool. Um, whatever listing you're on right here will have a star showing up and you click on driving directions and it automatically enters it into Street View so you're not having to manually do this okay and then you grab this little guy and any street that turns blue it'll automatically pop you right down on the street and you're now looking at the listing okay the listings gonna oh yeah there it is you're gonna say there it is from the pictures that you've been looking at Okay, and you're going to also move up and down the street. I'm going to sit here and click as fast as I can. And you're just like a car moving down the street here. Okay, you can check out the neighborhood, the schools, whatever you want to see. And you kind of double click, it zooms in a little bit for you. See? Zoom out. Zoom out. Okay, another feature here on the map section is at, that was driving directions on the map tab. Now we're going to show bird's eye map 
and now it will give us the pictures from the air with uh, Microsoft Virtual Earth te technology where they've actually flown an airplane in cross-grid fashion and now you're zooming in and, in and out and around the house get rid of this here you use these little functions to scroll out around the house so let's say that's your house you're now scrolling out around the side yard and check out the neighbor okay okay this is Brian Habel with SoUtah.com please go in there and, and sign up for your account you'll probably never ever get bothered I just want you to call me when you have a chance and, and you'd like to fill out a realtor I'd like to be a good shoe in I uh, help you on any short sales that you want to find information on here to serve appreciate having you thanks for being here